Kieran, good to talk to you. Uh, first of all, how's the recovery coming along? Yeah, it's going well. Um, yeah, just coming towards the end of my rehabilitation now, so um, literally it's my last run today, and then, yeah, just looking at, to get fit for pre-season. Good stuff. How did, how did you feel last season, went, both from a personal point of view and a team point of view, prior to the injury? Yeah, frustrations for me, um, obviously due to injury. I was out for 10 weeks at the start of the season with my ankle, um, sorry, that was my knee, uh, then my MCL, and then another 10 weeks now with, um, with my ankle. So yeah, frustrating season for me. Um, but yeah, uh, thankfully I'm glad to be back and um, yeah, kick on for next season. Good stuff, yeah. So looking to the season ahead, um, what do you make of the changes with obviously Nigel Adkins coming into to work as technical director with Ian Dawes as the manager and, and Neil Downs returning as well as assistant manager? Yeah, it's great. You know, um, I mean, I've, I've obviously I know Dawes, he was, um, as the assistant, for been working for him for three years now. Um, same with Parkey and, um, and Dandy as well. I played with him um, when I first came to Tramia. So, yeah, it's, it's great to be working with him. Um, and yeah, I'm looking forward to the next season, see how it goes. Yeah, so you're still only 28, but you're one of the, I suppose, senior members of a young squad because you've been here several years now. Do you feel you're taking on a new role in the squad because of this? Um, yeah, just maybe I'm just getting a bit more experience um, as I'm getting older. Um, no, I mean, I've been here for ages. Um, you know, I love it here. It's a massive club. Um, it's got big ambitions in terms of uh, facilities, fan base and... You know, it's a stadium. It's a, it's a club that shouldn't be in this in this league. Personally, um, I think we should be in the higher league. Um, so yeah, I think next season we've got a lot of work to do as a team and uh, try and try and achieve that. Yeah, I was just about to ask you as well. What are your expectations for the next year from a personal and from a team point of view? Yeah, just like I said, I'm obviously I want, I want to get promoted, uh, as does everyone else in the squad. Um, like I said, uh, the tram is a massive club. For this league, and um, this um, yeah, we shouldn't be in this in this division. Um, yeah, like I said, huge fan base, um, facilities, incredible like the training ground, stuff like that. So yeah, we we need to be we need to kick on next season. Um, I think uh, if you look at our home form the last two years, been really good. Um, whereas our away form hasn't been great. So obviously, it's the consistency. Uh, that we need to keep on top of to, um, to get results next season. I think we can, you know, keep winning our home our home games and then getting um, the results within the away games. I think we'll definitely be fighting for promotion 100%. So that's, that's what we've got to do.